Hello everyone and welcome back to Dusty Dan's Whiskey Reviews. So today we're going to be reviewing Backbone Bourbon Company's Bone Snapper X-Ray Straight Rye Whiskey. Now this is their four-year reserve. Um, it uses the 95% rye, 5% malted barley, which is the MGP mash bill. Um, comes in at 110 proof and uh, this is their batch number two, which was put in the barrel of June 2013 and barreled November 2018. Um, I have opened this up, obviously, to get some tasting notes, and I wanted to put down a review before I drink the whole thing, guys. So without further ado, let's go. All right, guys, welcome back. So I'm really excited to get into this one, guys. So let's go ahead and get into the nose. Picking up a lot of uh, like youthful um, rye spices on this one. The rye, the rye spice really kind of stands out. Nice, uh, nice cinnamon, uh, cinnamon note to it. Really nice, rich honey. But the rye spice itself really, really stands out in this one. Um, there's definitely some fruitiness in there a little bit further into the glass, some lemon, some orange peel. Maybe almost some, uh, almost like a, uh, an herbal quality to it too, on top of that rye spice. Maybe a, a, a touch of like, uh, of mint. But the rye spice I feel is definitely uh, the most dominant, uh, you know, the most dominant uh, aroma here on the nose, at least so far. Yeah, there's a little bit of red fruit in there as well. Um, like I said, some some of those lemons, some orange peel, citrusy uh, style nose. All right, guys, get into the palate. Cheers. So, so in that first sip, um, it's very um, spice forward on the front of the palate. Kind of mellows out as it goes down into the finish. But on the front of that palate is where you're picking up a lot of that fruitiness. Picked up like a nice red apple. And then like on the sides of the palate, you start to pick up some of that, um, some of that orange and some of that lemon, that citrus that, uh, that you were getting on the nose. That... Uh, that rye spice though is like uh that you know the first sip anyway is um definitely it packs a punch right on the on the front of the palate again like i said though it kind of kind of smooths out mellows out um as it goes into the finish nice white pepper note on the the back of the palate just kind of sitting there on the back of my tongue going into the finish love that white pepper finish on this one let's go to the second sip Yeah, so like I said before, you know, on the nose you're kind of getting like some of that um definitely a lot of those those grains, some of that um that youthful like rye. And on on the front of the palate again, you know, on that second sip, you definitely start to get some of that um those those grains again, some of that that uh those youthful like rye spices, the grains, you know, a little, a little grainy. But it really makes up for it on you know with, with with that balance that kind of, that kind of offsets it with you know that red apple is is definitely there definitely on the front of the palate there's almost some of that uh some of that that herbal quality to it too i can't quite make out what it is but it's definitely it's definitely there it's not earthy it's more just like like this this uh you know not grassy or anything like that it's more more of an herbal almost maybe like a tea almost like a black tea maybe black tea note it kind of sits on the middle of the palate with some of that uh, that orange and some of that lemon, and then that finish, that finish with that that white pepper, and there's definitely a little bit of a uh, little bit of like almost a almost a jam, like a uh, like like a an orange or like an orange or you know some kind of some kind of citrusy jam that kind of follows through into the finish with that white pepper is just it's really really nice. 
I love that. It, like I said, that kind of really offsets those youthful grainy notes um, that that you're getting here on the on the front of the palette. And they, they don't stick around. It kind of goes through pretty quick. Like I said, that 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 spice, um, you know, attacks the front and then you know smooths out, mellows out as it goes into the middle, to the back, and then to the finish. Let's get in the last sip, guys. Now that's it. That's it. That one changed a little bit. I got like a really big burst of vanilla right across the middle of the palette. Like vanilla bean. It's a straight vanilla bean. Rye spice is still right on the, on the front. Not as bad as that first sip. But then, again, that middle of the palette, you're getting that the, the, the orange and you're getting the lemon peel. And then there's that like black tea note that kind of sits like right on the middle of the palette as well. I really, really like that. I like that herbal, that, that herbalness and then that, uh, and then those, those citrus notes, they play very, very well together. It doesn't drink like it's 110 proof either. I would have never guessed, uh, if, if I had to drink that blind, I would have never guessed that that's 110 proof. I would have said maybe, maybe a hundred, if that. So very, very easy to drink. And again, you know, those rye spices mellow out. Um, smooth out from, you know, uh, the middle of the palate into the finish. The finish, you're getting that, you're getting that white pepper. You're getting like that, uh, like an orange, like jam almost that follows through into the finish. Um, short to medium finish, but it's really nice. It's a very flavorful one. Um, honestly, this is, this is a fantastic rye here um, from Backbone Bourbon. Um, I'd definitely like to try you know, one of their, one of the, their newer expressions, just to see how it, um, just to see how it compares to, to this one, you know, this one being, you know, 2018, um, they've obviously released some more, um, additional batches, um, you know, since then. So again, very, very nice, flavorful, spicy, bold, uh, rye from Backbone Burger Company. So I want to thank you guys for tuning into this episode of Dusty Dan's Whiskey Reviews. I want to send a big thank you to the folks over at Backbone Bourbon Company for supplying me with the bottle to review on the channel. Guys, if you're in the market for a big, bold, spicy, uh, well-rounded rye, this is where it's at. Do yourself a favor, go buy one of these. Um, again, very, very good stuff. Again, the, the youthful notes that you're getting on the front of the palate, some of those, those graininess, it's all made up by the, the fruitiness, the spicy... Um, well-rounded flavors from this rye. Very, very good rye. Uh, if I could find another one of these in my market, I would go and buy one instantly just to have it as a backup. Uh, very, very good stuff here from Backbone Burma Company. Um, guys, so with that said, if you're looking for more reviews like this, guys, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, bell notification to be alerted of any upcoming reviews or live streams. You can also find me on Instagram at Dusty Dan's Whiskey Reviews. And until next time, guys, stay dusty.